Welcome to the Social Science Reproduction Platform, a platform for crowdsourcing reproductions of social science research. The SSRP aims to make social science more computationally reproducible by facilitating systematic, detailed, and transparent assessments and improvements conducted by a community of researchers, instructors, and students like you. Computational reproducibility, or simply reproducibility, is the ability to reproduce the results, tables, and other figures found in research articles using the data, code, and materials made available by the authors. At the center of all reproductions is a reproducer, someone often not involved in the original research. Reproducibility is the foundation of scientific credibility because it allows researchers to examine, update, and build on each other's work. The SSRP is constructive in its approach to reproducibility. Rather than designating entire research articles as irreproducible, SSRP reproductions focus on specific research claims and their associated display items, like figures and tables, and identify concrete steps to make them more reproducible. So, how does the SSRP work? The SSRP facilitates reproductions based on a five-stage process, including selecting a paper, scoping, assessment, improvements, and robustness. Let's have a closer look at an example. First, reproducers select a paper, input its bibliographic information, and try to locate its reproduction package, containing data, code, and other materials necessary to reproduce it. At this point, if they've managed to obtain at least some reproduction materials, reproducers declare the paper and move forward with analyzing it. If there are no reproduction materials available, then they can record the paper as an abandoned project, leaving a record for future users. At the second stage, called scoping, reproducers identify the paper's main research claims and their associated display items. After filling out basic information regarding the paper and reproduction materials, reproducers identify results, tables, and other figures relevant to the reproduction. They can create their own reproduction package and choose whether to focus on all claims and display items or a subset for the remainder of the reproduction. A central stage of the reproduction is assessment, where reproducers review and describe in detail the original reproduction package and assess the selected display items' current levels of reproducibility using a 10-point scale. This scale accounts for the availability of data and code and whether the available materials faithfully reproduce the item of interest. For example, if one reproducer identifies a result to be reproducible at level 4 because of issues in running the analysis code, then they, or future reproducers, can debug the code and upgrade its reproducibility to level 5 and get credit for it. Such updates can be implemented at the improvement stage where reproducers attempt to make display items more reproducible. Better reproducibility can be achieved by correcting errors in the original code, obtaining missing data files, or adding instructions on how to access restricted data. Reproducers can also take steps to improve the reproducibility of the overall paper, such as rewriting scripts using open source software or writing a master script file to reproduce the entire paper. Finally, Reproducers can test the robustness of research findings by modifying analytic choices and reporting their effects on the results of interest. At any point of the reproduction, reproducers can share their work with peers and instructors through a shareable link, or in the SSRP forum, a moderated discussion board for all things SSRP. For example, users can visit the forum to get help refining code files as part of the improvement stage or get feedback on their reproductions before submitting. Users can choose to publish anonymously or keep reproductions private for a period of time, if necessary. The end product is a reproduction report, a citable research artifact that transparently documents the process to facilitate collaboration, discussion, and reuse. Get involved by signing up for a free account, browse through completed reproductions or begin a reproduction of your own, and help improve the platform by giving us feedback or requesting a feature. The SSRP is an open source project and was developed by the Berkeley Initiative for Transparency in the Social Sciences, an initiative of the Center for Effective Global Action, with generous support from Arnold Ventures. Check out socialsciencereproduction.org to get started.